Hi, I'm Jacob Road Ranger, and this is The Road Stuff. One of the basic needs natin as a writer is our helmet. Not just for legalities or para hindi ka mahuli, but for our safety. Since this is our first book, we want to make it a little bit special. Kinda limited edition. And when I say limited edition, I'm talking about this. And yes people, we are one of the luckiest person that will lay our hands into this beautiful Lorenzo de la Porta Signature Limited Edition Helmet. And what makes it so special is that meron lang tayong 500 units itong helmet na to dito sa Pilipinas. Ganun siya kakonti. And this helmet is around 889 over 2,599 helmet na ginawa. And for me, it doesn't matter talaga kasi you're part of the circle. Isa ka sa meron nito, doon pa lang, di ba? Malakas ka. And ito nga yung sinasabi nila, when you say limited edition, a collector's item, hindi mo to basta-basta ibibigay kung kani-kanino lam. And before we dig into this, I just wanna say thank you sa rightful owner nito sa pagpapahiram and letting us show this to everyone. By just looking at this helmet, talaga namang nakakapanghinayang gamitin. Siguro kung ako yung mayaring nito, bibilang ko ito ng glass na lagyanan. <laughs> ito, hindi ko ito tatanggalin. <laughs> ang, ang ganda yun. Oh. Diba? Tingnan nyo siya. Tingnan nyo yung details. So if you're in the same situation where in nanghihinayan ka na tanggalin itong sticker and also by just looking at it, talaga naman nakakapanghinayang talaga. Good thing, meron silang extra visor na meron din sariling lalagyan. Tinanggal ko na. Papakita ko na lang sa inyo. Thank you to KYT so we can preserve this sticker. It adds value to the uh, helmet talaga eh. Diba collector's item yan? Mas mataas value yun kapag original siya. The next thing to do is to look at the owner's manual on how to use it, how to change the visor, and to know the helmet itself. Now, let's take a look at the specification of the helmet. The shell of the helmet is made up of tricomposite shell. It contains carbon, fiberglass, and Kevlar. Now, let's discuss the weight of this helmet. This is my Spider Phoenix 2 and it weighs only 1,400 grams. On the other hand is the KYT Limited Edition weighs 1,350 grams. And Good job to the spider. To its price point, matibay to. Maganda to. Ito, sobrang ganda nito. Now, let's focus on this. A 1,350 grams. Magaang. Sarap nito gamitin when it comes to ride. Diba? And this is a track-oriented helm. What do you expect? Matibay, magaang, secured. When you say track-oriented, hindi pala siya strap it has a double d-ring to use for race standards and when it comes to its ventilation meron tong limang inlets for good airflow especially sa may init na bansa katulad ng sa atin
next thing to discuss is the field of vision of this helmet. I want to show you now the comparison of the field of vision of this helmet to my regular helmet. Okay, let's compare the spider helmet. Pantayan mga yan. Pantayan mga natin ang maayos. Yan. Pantay, pantay na sila. Kita nyo ba yung difference nito? Ang laki, di ba? Lalong lalo na dito sa Ibo. Pag dinigit mo, sa visor pa lang ay eh, pag binaba mo. Can you spot the difference? Talagang meron siyang malaking gap. Mas magandang field of vision ito. Good for racing talaga. Now, I just want to give a special mention to the paint job of this helmet. It gives you this astonishing color combination, especially with lights. It gives you this multicolor, glittery, pearl glossy helmet. See the details? See that? Pwede ka manalamin. Hi. And also another special thing about this helmet is that the paint job itself is a UV protected paint. So no worries when it comes to fading. And now we've all discussed the outermost part layer of the helmet. Now let's move on to its interior. Okay, let's appreciate the interior. Tignan na din mga simple details. Yung tahi yung design na parang dry carbon diba? consistent yung design sa loob may KYP and by just touching this guys sobrang lambot and I'm sure pag sinuot mo to mahimik talaga tong helmet na to mamaya sasubukan natin at eh medyo maingay sa lugar ko yan as you can see medyo nasa taas tayo and also guys I just wanna give a special mention to this see meron sya nito yung dalawa na yan it's for safety ang nadisgrasya ka you just need to pull this para matanggal agad yung helmet yung mga ganyan features, makikita mo lang yan almost sa mga high-end helmets hindi mo makikita yan sa katulad ng mga helmet natin na ganito double D rin kasi sya mahirap sya tanggalin talaga see the details of the thing ito double D rin diba? may nakalagay na KYT and since nasa interior na tayo guys just want you to compare this show you this guys you can see kung gaano kapal ang lining sobrang kapal nito into this maga ito ganyan sya ayan na laki ng gap Okay, this is the dual density EPS liner ng helmet na to. Nakikita nyo itong itim na to. Yan. Ito. Yan. Yung itim na yan. Yan. Pag pinindot nyo yan, soft sya. Bakit ganoon? It is to enhance the impact absorption when you are involved in a crash. Okay, susubukan natin siya ngayon, suotin. Meron mga kuliglig dyan sa paligid ko. Naririnig naman siguro dyan. Try natin siya suotin. Wow! As in, wow! Ang galang niya sa ulo! 
Parang wala na sombrero. <laughs> Grabe ang gangya sa ulo para ka lang nakasumbero All I can say nung sinuot ko to is wow talagang wow pagkasuot mo pa lang tumatahimik na yung paligid mo and nakabukas pa yung visor nun what more pa kaya pag nakasara Grabe nakakagiyang tong helmet na to and ang gangya sobra para ka lang nakasumbero and I think The last thing that we need to discuss about this helmet is the price point. For this helmet, limited edition, Lorenzo Della Porta signature helmet, 25,000. Depende sa dealer mo. Kusan ka makakabili? Uh, I heard na meron nito 20,000 to 25. That's the range of the price. Depende siya, pwedeng tumaas, pwedeng bumaba. And to its price point, sasabihin ko talaga, this is a deal breaker na. 25,000, you have a limited edition, quality, race ready helmet. Plus, it gives you this. The authenticity. Diba? Gold plate, luxurious ang tignan siya. So, I'm gonna give you a closer glimpse about this. Yan. Diba? From the helmet bag Tingnan nyo siya. Ilalagay ko Diba? Helmet bag Ganyan siya kaganda Okay before we end this video Just wanna say thank you again Sa may ari nito Sa pagpapahiram Fresh na fresh wala pa halos na galaw ay unang nangalikot sa helmet na to and talaga thankful ako dun maraming maraming salamat actually kakakuha nyo lang to eh nung isang araw eh et eh <laughs> kinuha agad natin so talaga sobra sobrang salamat and also sa mga nanood ng video na to maraming maraming salamat asahan nyo na ganito yung mga content natin more on informative also road safety yan naman ang uh, focus natin kaya natin binuo ang Road Ranger. Again, my name is Jack of Road Ranger. See you at the next one.